It's very important. Obviously, uh, you know, the haemophilia population have in the past been subjected to a lot of blood-borne viruses such as hepatitis B and hepatitis C. So we had a large cohort of people with haemophilia in the past who had hepatitis infections. Now, thankfully, hepatitis C treatments are very uh, successful. So the vast majority have cleared hepatitis C. But clearly, it's very, because the gene therapy is targeted specifically at the liver, and it does give a little jolt or shock to the liver, it's really important to ensure that the liver is in good health before gene therapy that that is checked and that is also continuously monitored during and after gene therapy.